bless me with loving a yes. Hey guys, PJ and I are home. And we are eating leftovers from Olive Garden while PJ is dancing and jumping. Dude, he jumps pretty good. Good jumps, man. Whoa, don't fall down though, okay? Let's see your dancing. He loves to dance. Whoa, no, no, don't fall. Because I don't want you to get hurt. Let's see your big jump. I like it when you jump so high without falling. Whoa! Big jump. PJ was messing with my laptop and he got some music to come on, so. I don't know where Annie is. I think she's picking something up, but it's like buy something. She ain't home yet. What kind of what kind of song is this? Um fried egg song. Some fried egg song. It's the kind of Music they always play on the surprise egg. Whoa, what are you doing? I get where my hands are. I'm going <laughs> up. Wow. And I put a full of. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you can stab me without dancing. What's me name? What's me name? What's me with? What's me name? What's me? What's me? What's me? What's me? Oh, watch me, 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 Nothing makes any matter than this right here. No, I hate it when this happens. And it was this last turn right here, and then like, I don't, there was a car behind me and I got nervous because I didn't signal, and then I like turned, and then everything went tumbling. Mm -hmm. She hates it. She I really do. does. I really do. <laughs> BJ's so hot. He's like sweating from his little dance party here. I had to take off his sweater. <laughs> You're such a good dancer. Where'd you get your dance moves from? Who taught you how to dance? Dad. Oh, Dad? <laughs> so we are home. I'm tired. I just came back from the market. Um, I bought some vegetables because my mom said she wanted to eat some like bok choy. So I bought that. I'm going to cook it up. I actually have a very busy night ahead of me. I got to go to her place and pick out some clothes because um, she's going to get moved to a different facility tomorrow. It's like going to be like a rehab center where she's going to stay for hey, about two weeks. So, you know, with the whole transport and everything we're not too sure like she probably needs clothes right she's probably not gonna Dad, go in her gown Mom, yeah baby get my rocket ship. oh your rocket ship oh, okay because you mess your i messed it up what did i mess up oh i'm sorry but they want to pull out your space. well you can take the pillows so anyway, um, yeah, I got to go pack some clothes for her, make her some food, and then head over there. And I don't want to go too late because, you know, she's got to, like, eat and stuff. So, uh, Lots to do. Oh, is that your rocket ship? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm going to my rocket ship. Oh. Well, what happened this morning? Oh. Golly, this morning I woke up and I, I normally turn on like a little space heater in our room because it's a little bit chilly. It's getting warm now, but force of habit, I turn it on right before I go to shower. 
and it wasn't turning on. I was like, what the heck? And then I noticed that our um, our alarm Dad. clock was like all Daddy. black. So I realized that yeah. we had a power outage and there was no power in the house at all. Hey, don't make a mess. Oh, PJ, you're making a mess over there, dude. So yeah, the entire couple of blocks I think was affected. There was just no power anywhere. Um, I decided not to even shower because I don't know, because it, it would have been kind of difficult, and then I wouldn't have. <laughs> you like that song? Yeah. Anyways. I wouldn't have been able to dry my hair with like a blow dryer or straighten it. So, you know, I didn't want to like risk catching a cold or, or doing something weird like that. So I just didn't even shower and I went to work. I think I look okay. I feel fine. Put some extra deodorant on, you know. But my face feels greasy. I did wash my face, but it feels kind of greasy. All right, now to fix this mess. Looking up the bok choy. I'm only making a little bit. She's not even going to finish all this. I'll probably just give her like half. So here's that cha siu that I bought, which is uh, the barbecue pork, the red barbecue pork. My mom had asked for that yesterday. So I bought a little bit and then along with that I just got the three item combo. I got chow mein, green beans, and some eggplant. Oh, and uh, chicken wings. So I'm just going to eat a little bit before I head out to my mom's. They're a little stingy with the chicken wings. They only gave me three pieces. <laughs> so I'm at my mom's house right now. Feels a little bit weird to come back, I must say. I got a little anxious, a little scared driving uh, on the way over here because I don't know, I just feel like, I guess I kind of feel like returning to the scene of the crime because I haven't been back here since, uh, since I found my mom. So she had fallen right there in this area right here. I think she was by the refrigerator either going to the kitchen or coming out of the kitchen, I'm not too sure, but yeah, it just feels a little weird. But now that I'm here, I feel okay. Um, I'm making a little bit of rice so I can take it to her. And you know, just doing things like checking her, her mailbox and packing up some of her clothes and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm just kinda making a really short trip. I water some plants and things like that. It was kind of weird because right when I got in the door, the phone rang. And I was like, who's calling like right now, <laughs> like right as I was walking through the door? I thought maybe it was the neighbor because um, she has this one neighbor that's really, really um, kind. And she helps my mom out a lot. She'll like take take her trash can out and bring it in and stuff like that. So I thought maybe it was the neighbor. Maybe she saw, you know, saw me pull up and was wondering what's going on with my mom or something like that. But it was actually her friend, my mom's friend. Um, she was worried because she said she called a few times and nobody picked up. And, you know, I had, to, I had to break it to her that she fell. And But she's doing good. She's doing better. So, you know, I don't think... I don't think all of her friends know yet uh, what had happened, so. All right, so I've been here probably about 30 minutes. I think I'm done, ready to head out. It's about 7.30. So by the time I get to the hospital, I think it'll be about maybe like 8 p.m. Got my mom's rice with cha siu and some bok choy in PJ Spider-Man thermos, so. I think we're ready to head out. I'm tired, but it's okay. Oh my gosh, Prego Brain's over here. I forgot her bag of clothes. Hello. Good thing I didn't start driving yet. Hey, Bubba. <laughs> the first thing he asked me was, was Bubba feeling better? And I said, yeah. 
PJ, you're wearing your Christmas <laughs> sleeper? Does um, that have a Santa on it? No, I'm wearing Santa pajamas. Santa pajamas? Oh, I guess Dad couldn't find any of your other pajamas. What? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Were you a good boy? Yeah. Yeah? You had a good time? Yeah, because I eat chocolate and I got five bites and I make five bites and I get the chocolate. Oh my goodness. Good job. If I made 20 points. 20 points? How did you make 20 points? I went, I go be quiet <laughs> and daddy and the black game and the yellow team. Oh my goodness. Did they win? Mm, I won. Oh, you won. Okay. And daddy won too. Oh, so everybody's a winner? Yeah. Cool. PJ likes it when everybody wins, huh? Yeah. Yeah. And I mm, we take off. And we take off all the things. Oh. All right, guys. We're tired. It's been a long evening, so I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up. Subscribe below. Bye, guys. At the same exact time, and they saw us through the window. So we're gonna just...